last question, Dr. Dalek. Are you sure the perimeter surrounding the zone is really enough? If a powerful emission were to occur, we... Listen, the zone has remained stable for years. Besides, we didn't establish the most advanced institution in human history without first guaranteeing its safety. As the head of the Scientific Institute for Research of the Chernobyl area, or Circa for short, I believe the wonders that we will bring to the world far outweigh the potential risks. How big are these risks exactly? <laughs> the zone reveals a whole new world. We can stick with the old one, fearing change. But tell me, do you want our descendants to remember us as cowards? Or as those who dared to venture forward to a new, better humanity. The injured were evacuated. I remind our listeners that a similar incident happened in our region quite recently, ruining homes and livelihoods. City officials urge people to stay calm, assuring them the situation is totally under control. back there? Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. Zone is really raging today. See that? It was a hell of a blast. Can't remember one. So fierce. Are we uh, close? Uh, kind of. The central checkpoint could be on alert after the emission, but there's another way in. Crack in the wall to the left of the fault. Bugger off! Hope you didn't lose your secret artifact along the way. If it was outside the zone for too long, it would have lost its anomalous energy. <clears throat> but I've got this shiny metal thing to recharge it. One lucky activation, and we have a gold mine here. Sector 9, visual detection of the vault. I say again, Sector 9, visual detection of the vault. Show me what you found. What the hell is this? I've seen artifacts taken from the zone before. They always burn out and fall apart real fast. But this one? This one is not from the zone. Oh, I bet. Where'd you find it? In my laundry basket. <sighs> Who do you think you're talking to, huh? You have any idea what this scanner cost me? If it's not an artifact, it's gonna blow us all to hell! I won't let my hard work come to nothing because of you. I won't let you flush it down the shit. Ah! <laughs> this stone owes me a new home. We gotta move. Get to the scientist's bunker. Nehoda will explain how to proceed with the scanner. He's waiting for you. Good luck. Sit right. 
left. Perimeter breached. Extensive damage caused by... Oh, fuck knows what. Copy that. Dispatching a response team. Investigate the scientist's bunker.
I think it'll be that easy, but I'll figure it out. The goat is dead. So are the other scientists. Dead? Oh, God. We're screwed. Get out of there immediately. Stop freaking out. And tell me where the data is stored. Find his laptop. The coordinates should be in there. Goat is dead. I'm Mr. Client. Whoa! That's a hell of a mess you got there, boys. Well, screw that smart ass bastard. I never liked him anyway. Hold on a sec, Mr. Client. Did Herman at least tell you what to do with the coordinates? I'll figure it out. One way or another. Sounds good to me. Well, the teapot's boiling. Over and out, Mr. Client. Do you have the coordinates? I hope you do. Things are about to get a little more complicated from here. Good thing it's been a walk in the park until now. First, find the detector. This is a mobile lab. The scientists ought to have at least one. I've already got a detector. To acquire an artifact to shield yourself from a scanner's radiation. If you don't, 
You might end up joining Nagoda. How? Find an anomaly. After the emission, it shouldn't be that difficult. Then use the detector signal to navigate it. If the stalkers have figured it out, I'm sure you can too. After that, attach the artifact to your belt and go plant the scanner. Just try not to get killed in the anomaly. That would be rather embarrassing. Okay. Is uh, charging always this noisy? No, but that rock of yours is pretty unusual. Check the scanner quick. Is it charged? Cover me, boys. I'm hiding.
Calm down. I've got some time left. Heading for the next spot. Solder's premium corvettes smell like a scam. His coordinates always work like a job. But the emission could have thrown a wrench in the works. We'll find out soon. One spot left. Did you hear me? Drop the damn scanner and come back right now! I've got nowhere to go back to, Herman. Over and out.
sign of anomaly. What? I see the scanner. Tracing for anomalous activity in radio signals. Situation unclear. You, inside. You, to the roof. Move out. HQ, move out reporting. Come in, HQ. Damn it! Doka PDA detected. Someone here! Oh, no. Some fireworks, huh? Who are you? I'm your guardian angel. Here's a bolt. Where the hell would I need a bolt? Take a look around. Ah, oh, crap. Yep. Toss it into the anomaly, then while it resets, run like hell. Got it? Now go. <clears throat> I didn't really know, but I sure hoped you would. <laughs> How'd you get here without any gear? Long story short, bad luck. By the way, I'm looking for someone nicknamed Sauter. Know anywhere I could uh, ask around about him? If you're looking for somebody, go to Zalicia. Talk to Warlock, the local bartender. He might know something. Or maybe not. It depends. Squint. Damn it, man. Settle some scores, didn't you? Shit. The timing couldn't be any worse. The 
bastard shot him at point blank. Then took everything, even the sensors. Fuck. Now the entire lesser zone is gonna have to clean up this mess. Why is your ass still here? Head over to Zalisha and keep your mouth shut. Unless you want both of us killed. First drink after the emission is on me. Fuck them up pretty good, eh? <laughs> I didn't expect anyone to step in for me. That's rarer than Mama's beats around here. Normally, folks in the zone just walk past other people's troubles. They've got their own shit to deal with. You are new around here, ain't ya? I am, to be honest. Yeah, I figured as much. But you have definitely taken out a few scab bags in your day. Thanks for having my back. I might be pushing my luck here, but could you lend me a hand with something else? All right, let's hear it. There's four of us at the boiler house, not far from here. Squint, Richter, Gloomy, and myself. Squint is the leader. Richter is his right-hand man. And we just joined Spa... Uh, a group. 
Squint and Richter took off somewhere in the morning, and then me and Gloomy got ambushed by those bandits. I, uh, uh managed to make a tactical retreat, but the bastards took Gloomy. I don't know what they are doing to him, but I doubt they are throwing him a party. We need to rescue him and make those thugs regret it. Gloomy will find a way to return the favor. All right. I'll do it. For real? Dude, you rock. Don't worry, I won't just send you there empty-handed. I've got a stash close by. It's got everything you need. A gun, some ammo, the whole shebang. Whatever you don't use, consider it yours. Just make sure you've got Gloomy's back, all right? They tried. That's the zone for you. Take care out there. And, uh, try not to hit Gloomy, all right? He may be a son of a bitch, but he's still my bro.
Who sent you? Richter or that asshole Jorik? Jorik asked me to get you out of here. He asked you to wipe his ass, that's what he did. You think those goons were brought down here by the emission? Jorik lost a wad of cash playing cards in garbage and figured he could hide out here. Well, the fucker wasn't completely wrong. They didn't get him. They got me! What you looking at? Expecting a reward? Check the pogs. I'm just glad they left me my suit. Wait a sec. They didn't take the detector! Those scumbags think they're too good to dive into anomalies looking for artifacts. Easier to shake down a loner on his way out. Assholes. That'll do. Hand it over. Here you go. There's an anomaly in the cave. Appeared right after the emission. Maybe the detector will help you sniff something out. Thanks for the help, stalker. But don't count on anyone standing up for you if you run into trouble. You'll be better off that way. All right, you stupid asshole. Get over here. Tommy, you have no idea how glad I am. Why don't you come a little closer? Let me get a better idea. Uh, I've got something I need to take care of, so... Why don't you take a breather and cool off? I'll be right back. Dumbass. Even at the best of times, I'm not one for small talk. And right now is definitely not the best of times. How long have you been in the zone? Long enough. People don't end up in the zone because their lives were all sunshine and rainbows. Although it ain't that great here either. As you can tell. Still beats the life I had back on the mainland though. So long, rookie.
dogs jump to the zone either looking for something or running from something. But when they stay, they stay for the zone itself. See ya. I'm looking for Sauter. Nope. Talk to Gaffer. That's him over there. What do you want? Sit down and stay out of sight. Three of my men never reported back from their overnight patrol around the Lesser Zone. We found their bodies by the old bridge. Hey, soldier, over here. What do you call three dead wardens up the zone's ass? A good start. <laughs> <laughs> the traitor who goes by hamster is peddling this service weapon. It belonged to one of those wardens. He got it from Squint. Apologies, Captain, but Zalicia is a free trade zone. We have an agreement with Korshinov. Where is Squint? The zone has its share of secrets. Who are we to meddle in its designs? Playing a wise and stalker sage, are you? Fine. Squint was there for sure. He finished off the wounded and looted their bodies. Is that the stalker way now? Who am I to judge? If you won't tell me, others will. Seize them! Easy now. Nobody's going anywhere. If you don't want the innocent to suffer, find me the culprit. Well then, in times of war, the law falls silent. Hey, Stalker. Must have been you here. Come over here. Let's have a chat. That's how we're all here in Zalicia. Less maniacs are gonna drink all my vodka in the street. If anyone asks, I'm at home and busy. Anyone at all? Anyone. Don't buy into that whole dog and pony show, rookie. Gaffer's been uppity because it's out of Latson. If Korshinov was here instead of him, would have been standing against the wall already. The captain prefers a more diplomatic approach. <laughs> so, who should I ask about Sodder? Try Zodov. The ward can find anyone you want as long as you can cut a deal with them. And you're okay with their methods. Or you could ask Gaffer. Just give him some time to get to his house. He's an easy young guy. He usually helps rookies out, but he's had to deal with a year's worth of crap today. See ya. Good luck. First drinks on the house if you need it. And I get the feeling you're gonna need it. If you need anything, stop by. <laughs>